Dr. Yesis, we're going to take a look at one of the top defensive backs coming into this year's draft. He's out of the University of Nebraska. His name is Prince Amukamata. Would you please tell us what you think of his overall technique? Okay, sure. Uh, and here we have, we brought him up here. So this is Prince here, and we're playing uh, from Nebraska, playing Texas. Now, they're running downfield. He's a receiver and being covered by Prince. So he's keeping in good step with him, you know, looking at him. So I notice he's making his stops here. We won't go into his technique, but he's taking many stops, many steps. And the same thing here, we see wide angle stopping. Look how low he gets. Anytime you see anyone get this low, especially with both feet, it indicates a lack of good eccentric strength. So he's not going to be able to respond very quickly in terms of a change of direction. The higher you are, the more quickly you can change direction. But he's putting that he's putting the stop sign to stop his forward momentum, but he has to sink all the way down to the ground. Fortunately, this guy is taking many steps, but he's still getting it slightly in front. See, so notice after he gets going again, he's able to come around and he's in front. Anytime he's in front, he's going to be able to get the ball. So that's always a good sign. If he would be alongside him instead of behind him, which you're going to see in a few minutes, see, so he's behind him. So he's not going to be able to stop any pass being caught directly in front of him. Uh, of the Texas player. So this is not the most effective technique. Let's go back a little bit and make, take a little better look at his footwork. See, so notice when he's so low over here, see, the lower you go, the more stable you become. It's like you're glued to the ground. It takes a while to get up and get more going again. See, so we see some footwork going back and forth, but not going anyplace. Until he finally gets himself turned around, but Williams is already getting in front. So in essence, Williams has to jump on him. They were quite a bit apart. Williams goes into him, but he doesn't care. He's in front of him now. See, this thing stride for stride now. turns around so poor on his part now Prince is starting to look better being in his side facing position but look all that up and down motion so both of them are not exhibiting very good well they never got it so anyway uh, that's just to uh, take a look that initial cutting action he didn't have a good shot cutting action See, that was the main point I want to bring out that he's stopping action and getting started again or relatively speaking, fairly poor. See, and you can't judge, you know, how good someone is by looking at how bad someone else is. Because the other person doesn't do it well, doesn't make that you are doing it right, or you're doing it most effectively. So we have to take a look at both. And when we evaluate a player, he should be evaluated on his movements, not necessarily what the other person is doing, except if it's in relation to him, uh, and other things involved. But here we see a little bit of discoordination there. Okay, that should do that one.